preparation of the roof, here we pressure washed this roof. This is 6,000 square feet. We pressure washed it the day before. Then we went up and blew the leaves off that morning. We taped around all the vent pipes and protrusions using the contouring seam tape. Then we used a piston airless sprayer and sprayed Elasta Barrier around the skylights and around the perimeter. You don't have to coat the whole roof with Elasta Barrier, just, just your ponding areas and around vent pipe skylights and protrusions. That's the Elasta Barrier being applied. And then we top coated the whole roof with the maximum stretch. These are two inch by 50 foot rolls. It's also available in four inch and six inch. This is kind of a cutaway of how you do a tar roof. I touched on that briefly, but you've got the flashing here. You got your tar surface. And what we do is we put down a coat of the Elasta Barrier rubber first. We embed the fabric into the wet coating. Then we apply another wet coat of elastobare and we laminate that fabric on there. And what that does is it girdles the roof. So if that roof shifts or moves in the future, that coating is reinforced with polyester cloth fabric. So it, it cuts down on movement substantially. And then we top coat it with two coats of the maximum stretch coating. So you've got the tar roof. You seam tape your seams. Elastobarrier fabric, elastobarrier and then maximum stretch. That's how you do a standard tar roof.